guys and welcome back to my channel in this video i'm going to provide you the solution to fix your memory management bsod which you are getting in your windows 10 and in windows 11 while playing games or even while using your desktop for simple or small applications so without wasting time let's go ahead and proceed with the fixes the very first and basic fix that i will share with you is to make sure you check the RAM sticks that are connected to your system are properly connected. I mean, unplug the RAM sticks from your system and then plug it again to make sure that they are connected again. This is a major issue which is giving you the memory management error in your Windows PC. And nextly is to make sure your CPU is not overheated. So, check the temperature of your CPU in your task manager so that you make sure that the temperature of your CPU is normal and it is not causing you or giving you the BOC, BSOD error memory management. So these are the basic steps that you need to perform. Now let's proceed with the advanced steps. Click on the start menu and this time type CMD, run CMD as an administrator. One more thing I'll clear you friends that the error called memory management is caused because of the failing hard disk or the RAM sticks in your system. So let's proceed by fixing the software issues. In command prompt you need to type sfc space slash scan now and then hit the enter key. This command will take some time and once it is completed go ahead and proceed with second command. Second command is, let me go ahead and open command prompt. Second command is dism space slash online space slash cleanup hyphen image space slash restore health and then hit the enter key. One more thing friends, make sure you perform both the commands one by one not to perform these two commands simultaneously else even these commands will heat up your system and may result in bsod error of memory management so make sure you perform each step one by one now once both these commands are completed let's proceed with the third command always open cmd as an administrator Third command is check disk space the letter of your C drive which is C space slash fix space slash R and space slash X. Before proceeding let me clear you friends that this command will not complete it properly because it needs to lock down your C drive and which is only possible after you restart. Hit the enter key. Now as it is saying that the you cannot current log drive that's why it cannot proceed so here you need to type the y key and then hit the enter key which means once you restart your system this command will go ahead and check your hard disk for the error and repair them automatically once you restart your system i'll go ahead and close all three commands but make sure you perform these three commands one by one to fix out the issue now let's proceed with the next step to fix your memory management error. Right click on start menu and choose the option device manager. Here you need to expand your display adapters because graphic driver is one of the major cause for memory management error. So here note it down the name of your graphic driver. If it is occurred due to a recent update then right click and choose the option properties. Click on the driver tab and if rollback option is there, it is available, choose the option rollback to proceed with the resolution. If not, simply note down the name of your graphic driver. At my end, it is Intel SD Graphics 5500. You need to open the official website of Intel, AMD, Nvidia and Intel depending upon the type of graphic you have in your system. As I have Intel, so I will choose Intel website and click on this graphic option.
now here you will find the series of your intel hd graphics now from here choose your operating system which is windows 10 or windows 11 and click on your operating system and here is the graphic driver right in front of you for windows 7 for windows 10 click on it and simply download them and install just like you install any other program or game in your system as it is for nvidia also here is the details that you need to provide and fill in using the product type and series and then language and hit on the search button and this will find the driver and hit the download button to get the download link for windows 10 or windows 11. This is also an exe application so just save it and install it in your system. As it is for AMD also you can search your product right over here by typing the name of your product else simply click on this graphic option and just choose the series of your AMD and then hit the submit button to find the download link of your relevant graphic drivers. Depending on the type of system you have simply download it by clicking on the download button and save it in your system. Once they are saved go ahead and install it and restart your system and this will fix out your issue of memory management. Now if all this method fails the last hope the last resort we have is to verify that our RAM and hard disk is working properly. For that I have a software with the name memtest you need to open its official website and click on the option download. Choose the free version to download it in your system. Now once it is downloaded go ahead and open the folder. Now you need to extract all these files first. Right click and choose the option extract all. Now you need to use a USB drive with a minimum of 4 GB or 2 GB of space and then run the file with the name image USB to write all these files into a USB drive so that this will verify the genuinity of your hard disk as well as RAM. Now select your USB drive I have already inserted a USB drive and I click over here to select it. Now just choose the option write it will completely format your USB drive so that's why it is asking to proceed or not. Click on the yes button to proceed and again yes button and this will start it to write the old data into your USB drive. Now the imaging is complete this way we have created a bootable USB of this memtest software. Now go ahead and close your system restart it and give boot using the newly created USB that we have just created with the help of this mem test. I will go ahead and restart my system for you. Now I will go ahead and start my system by giving the boot to my USB disk. Here is my USB disk which is scan disk. I will choose it and then hit the enter key. And here is the mem test started reading my hard disk and RAM of my system. Now you need to choose the config option to start the RAM test. Using your mouse click on the config option. And from this left pane click on the option start test to start testing your RAM sticks. Now you can see that it has started testing my RAM and here you will find the two option of pass as well as errors. These are the four tests that will be done by the mem test by first, second, third and fourth and next to the errors it will show the error if this test found any errors in your RAM stick. If this software found even a single error in your RAM sticks that means that you will again encounter with the same error of memory management BSOD and you need to replace your RAM if you do not want again the same error which is of memory management. One more thing friends to make this test works properly you need to do the same test at least 
five to six times to get the desired results. I'll go ahead and cancel the test for now because it will take some time to finish it. I'll go ahead and end the test. And here is the test completed. Press any key and this will display the results. From here, you will get to know if there are any errors in your RAM sticks or not, which is giving you the error of memory management. Now even it will provide you the HTML report if you want. Simply the test is completed. Now go ahead and restart your system and this will completely fix else provide you the proper resolution on what you need to proceed to fix your error of memory management in your Windows PC. For now, this is all about it friends. If you are new to this channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to continue receiving more such updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.